really fucking good. Hello. Welcome. If you're new here, if you've been here before, then welcome back. Today we've got two gameplays for you. We've got a 20 bomb and a 15 kill gameplay. And this was using the Max Fire 8 bar setup. I came across this setup just scrolling through TikTok, saw it, and I thought, looks like quite a fun gun to use. Turns out that the TTK on it is actually very, very good. Not only that, the recoil on it is really easy to control. The only downside to it is the mag size is only 30 round, and with it being a max fire rate build, you can imagine that you get through that pretty quickly. Saying that, I found this gun really fun to use and is actually quite competitive just because of how fast it can kill. I think it was great as like a sniper support. The only downside to using this compared to using the SMG is it is a little bit slower um, moving around. Um, so I'll put the attachments on screen for you now. As you can see, most of the attachments that we're using, every one that affects the fire rate that increases it, we've put on. So we've got the magazine that increases the fire rate as well as the recoil booster and the barrel as well. Um, everything else is either for recoil control or movement speed. So the remove stock, um, we've got the carver foregrip. You can swap this out for the hand stop as well. You get a bit better recoil control with the hand stop. The only difference between the carver foregrip and the hand stop is you get a little bit better hip fire with the carver. So because I'm running it more as an SMG rather than an AR, if you're not aiming down sight straight away, that little bit of extra hip fire accuracy can just help you out a little bit. And for your perks, I've got sleight of hand just because, as I've said, it's only a 30 round and that's the max you can get. So it does help out if you get stuck in a bit of a tricky situation. And of course, fully loaded, it's pretty much the go-to. The only thing I will say about this, as making this video, um, the rebirth update has just gone live. Obviously, this is on the old map uh, without any of the updates. Now, I am using Hollow Point on this build. Um, not sure if any of you are aware, Hollow Point has just been nerfed. Um, not for the damage or anything like that, it's actually for the damage range. So I believe it now takes off 20% of the damage range of your gun. With an AR, it's not so much of a problem because they've got pretty good damage ranges anyway. But if you want to change that out because you want the max damage range possible that you can get out of the build, then maybe just chuck on something like Lengthened or something like that. I'm going to leave you guys with a gameplay. Uh, we've got two games, as I've said earlier in the video. Uh, the first one, a 15 kill gameplay. The second one, we drop a 20 bomb. If you do enjoy the video, then please like. It just helps get that video out there for more people to see. And if you enjoy what you see on the channel, then drop a subscribe. Over here, I love trying out different guns, different builds. I'm not into just using the same meta every day, all day. If you want to try some different guns, you want to look for some out there builds, this is definitely the channel that you want to subscribe to because we're going to be putting that out there. Also, I'm thinking about starting a series where I've noticed a few of you, if you've come from the TikTok channel, um, I like editing quite a lot. I tend to think I've got quite good at editing uh, over the couple of years that I've tried to learn it. Um, I'm thinking that I could maybe do a couple of tutorials just to show you guys how I edit my gaming videos, especially for TikTok, just to help you guys out if you want to edit some of your own TikToks. I know obviously you can pay for the editing, but it can be very expensive at times. So if that's something you're interested in, let me know. I can bring those videos out for you guys, maybe help you out and just give you some tips on how to edit your own videos. Anyway, I'll let the gameplay run. If you do end up using this build, let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed it, if you liked it, if you didn't like it. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.